Uh, I will use this uh, opportunity to uh, talk about IIT Tirupati. Uh, as all of you know, it's a new IIT. Uh, so you may be wondering where, uh, how much we have progressed and where we're going. So I'll make a presentation about uh, uh, our progress and uh, what are the possible opportunities for young uh, faculty members to join IIT Tirupati. So I'll share my screen uh, and uh, make the presentation. Okay. Um, so what we see on the screen here is the, on the right side is the campus that has been already built. Actually, the picture there is almost uh, a few months old. We made much more progress after that. Uh, and uh, just to give you a little bit perspective, uh, as uh, most of you must be aware, uh, we are the third generation IIT. You know, we had the first generation IITs uh, uh, from IIT Karakpur to, uh, to uh, University of uh, Roorkee when it became IIT Roorkee. That we considered them as the first generation IITs. And then in 2008, we had the second generation IITs that started. And in 2015 and 16, another six IITs uh, started at, uh, Medra, at uh, Tirupati, Palakkad, uh, Goa, Darwad, uh, Bilai, and Jammu. So the two IITs at uh, uh, Tirupati and Palakkad have been mentored by IIT Madras. So I'm basic, I'm also from IIT Madras. I had come here uh, in 2015 as the representative of the Mentor Institute, uh, professor in charge to start the IIT and had the, and then subsequently became the director in 2017, January. So there's been continuity on how uh, we've been developing this institute. Uh, so the, uh, we had the Foundation Stone program laying uh, uh, in March 2015. Um, you know, among the new third generation IITs, it was the first uh, Foundation Stone program to be held. It was a massive event uh, where uh, we had the then Union Minister, uh, Srimati Smriti Ranaji came and uh, laid the Foundation Stone in the presence of uh, then Union Minister uh, and current uh, Vice President of India, uh, Sri Venkai Garu, and uh, the Chief Minister, then Chief Minister, and his cabinet representatives, and so on. And there was a, it was a joint foundation stone program for IIT Tirupati, Isa Tirupati, and uh, IIIT Sri City. Uh, so we have all of the, all the three of us had the same foundation stone program on the same day. In 2015, we started off with our BTEC programs in four streams. Uh, in civil engineering, computer science and engineering, electrical engineering, and mechanical engineering. And subsequently, in 2018, uh, we started the BTEC program uh, in uh, chemical engineering. I'm sorry, in 2019. Uh, and uh, we started our research programs uh, in 2017 uh, with the MS and PhD programs. Um, and in 2017, also the detailed project report for setting up of this uh, six new IITs was approved by the cabinet. Uh, till then, we were running on an initial grant the government had given us. In 2018, we started our MTech programs uh, in uh, mechanical engineering and electrical engineering. And in 2019, we started the civil engineering program, uh, MTech programs. Uh, and uh, uh, we are looking at uh, the completion of our first stage project. Actually, we, we have already built a part of the campus and moved in and started operations from there uh, in 2018 itself. And uh, I, will, I will discuss how we, our campus is growing. And by 2024, we hope to complete a full campus in all respects, which will cater to 250 faculty members and about 2,500 students and the associated staff. 